Good morning, happy Halloween, October 31st, 2022. I am here, it's uh, Monday morning, I'm back at the dacha, and check this out, that was from yesterday. We burnt the pile, but I am going to continue burning. So yesterday, I didn't want to burn this, I wanted to save it for today, otherwise this pile would be going all night. Uh, Vika and I were here till about 8 o'clock. We had to wait for it all to get burnt out or burned down. Anyways, I need to rake it all up and then I'm going to start at it again. So what are we going to be doing? Well, let's check it out. Okay, so I've been grabbing from here uh, all these cans and stuff. Roofing material, have to separate it into a pile eventually we'll take it to the garbage dump this wood right here it's not building material it's rotten it's dry rotten so we'll have to put it into the pile and i'll probably go into this shed here or the two sheds that are falling down <laughs> i've got boards basically just holding them up inside i'm gonna go through anything that is of no value but it's dry burn it as long as it's not plastic or anything that is toxic so that's my plan for today I'm not doing any kindling i'm doing a big cleanup so i've got to make this place look into my paradise all right gotta get to work okay so we're gonna light the fire so here it is and there it is So we piled up what was here and I ran to my uh, little wood section there and cleaned up the sawdust and the little pieces which are really dry so now I could start the fire and we're going to keep it going for a couple hours. Got to torch everything that we have here, anything that's burnable, especially that area right there. And I'll probably go into those two sheds. There's one on the right and one on the left there. And we'll pull something out. And then we'll even go to our new dacha. And we'll see what we can either bring here or we'll light another fire there. So yeah, it's a good day for burning. This is it. Gotta get back to work. Okay, well, the sun is going down. I think I'm done for the day in this section here. I cleaned it out as much as I could. I know that this junk pile here, this trench is going to have to be cleared so that the water could flow because there is a pond just right over here about, I don't know, 60 feet away. Anyways, I don't know what it's like in the spring, how much flow there is, but... Anyways, it's much better than what it was. That's the thing. So, I still got to stick around. Let my fire die out. So, while I'm going to be waiting, maybe an hour or so, I'm going to walk over to our other lot there where we just purchased. And I'm going to start collecting the wood and stuff and uh, making a pile. So, that's that. So while this is going to be burning down, I'm going to go and see what I can collect and make a pile there so that I can burn on that side. Anyways, this is <laughs> big work in progress over here, but uh, I'm motivated. I'm going to get this sucker done. It's going to look really, really good. Yeah, I'm definitely going to tear that down, those sheds there. I don't know, like, they look like garbage. It looks like some kind of troll lives in there. Anyways, so yeah, I must have hauled, I don't know, like three tons of wood, at least a couple cords. I cleaned out in the shed there, and there was tons of stuff in there. Just kept digging and digging. There's lots of metal. 
So in the springtime, I'm going to have to go to the garbage dump and take stuff to the garbage dump. Anyways, I got to get back to work. I got to go over to our new lot over there and see what I could do. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, so we purchased this lot, uh, I don't know, two weeks ago. And there's lots of stuff that has to be burnt here and cleaned up. So, like I said earlier, there's the smoke coming out of my pile that's burning. While that burns down, I'm going to walk around here and see what there is to burn. Well, I got to get rid of these boards and see if I can pull those pegs out of the ground. Uh, those window panes, I'm not sure if there's windows in there or they're just uh, the frames. Anyways, I think I'm going to make the pile right here, right here, so I can gather everything out and just start making it beautiful. So yeah, we're going to integrate this property with that property, and it's going to be one big property. Anyways, I got to start walking through. I'm going to take my little saw, snip, 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 and start making a pile. I don't think nothing will get burnt over here. And you know, like that's in danger. So yeah, guess we're gonna start. Okay, gotta get to work. So I've decided to go with the burning barrel over here instead of having it on the ground, the fire. Um, I noticed the barrel was right over there, right where that uh, rusty plastic is. And uh, there were some holes in this barrel and I thought well why not just use it as a burning barrel so now the air could be sucked in and it can burn the only downside is uh, I can't really have a huge fire but that's okay um, all this right here is dead so it's just little branches I can snap them up and make them into manageable pieces dump them in forest air will be coming in and it'll burn like a big huge chimney so there it is so tomorrow weather forecast is for rain so that's fine I'll come out here after work and I think I'm gonna use one of these glass panes here just to cover this up because it's dry I don't want it to be wet tomorrow I will uh, come here and fire it up let it go and little by little, little by little, I am going to clear all this out. All this out. So now this little pond belongs to us. Well, half of it. The other half belongs to the other neighbors. So we used to have a quarter of it. Now we have half of it. Anyways, so take a look at all this right here. I mean, it's a jungle out there. Yeah, monk. <laughs> and... Uh, I'm gonna clear it. So I did some thinning out right here. This lilac right here, uh, you know, if I thin it out, it'll grow better. Same with this right here. This looks like some sort of a berry tree, but I'm not sure what it is. I'll have to ask Victoria. Anyways, there's lots of dead branches in there. So again, I'm gonna prune it. Anything that's dead, that's fair game, take it out. Anything that's green, I mean, it's going to be helping it grow. So there it is. Now we're clearing up here. All right, got to get back to work. To be on the safe side, I figured that I would douse the fire here, whatever was left of it. There's just a bit of charcoal. So I got my water going here, and I gave it a good soaking. And I'm going to stick around a bit and uh, douse it a bit more. And the cool thing is, right over there, I found the screen. So I'm going to actually put it, lay it on top of the wheelbarrow, and then I'm going to screen some of this charcoal because there is uh, there's some metal here and there, door hinges and stuff. So I'll take them out, and then I'm going to put everything, all the charcoal right here, and then till it up. So, uh, yeah, this is what we're going to do, or what I'm going to do. So I, I found, I figured out what to do with this pile of charcoal. Yeah, just uh, sift it, 
won't take me long. I don't know, maybe two, three hours. So what? I got time. And then I will lay it all out wherever I can and till it up. And we're going to have nutrients in the garden. So maybe I should give it a little bit more water here. So just a little bit of water into the hot spots. Yeah, this sort of looks like Hawaii. Yeah, lots of steam. Yeah, like the volcanoes in Hawaii. Anyways, so yeah, I'm just gonna douse it a bit more. Probably stick around here for another 15, 20 minutes. And once I know that it's all out, there's no uh, steam coming up. I know that the steam is where the hot spots are. And that's it. All right. Got to get to watering. Well, I got it all out. Uh, I don't think it's going to flare up. I must have put a couple hundred gallons. I don't know, maybe a thousand liters. A lot. I spent the last 20 minutes pouring onto it. So it's out. And tonight it's also going to be cool. So it's not going to flare up. And tomorrow it's supposed to rain. So it's good. Now I got to go home. So there it is. That is my day. There we go. Looking around. Oh. That's the Trans-Siberian Railway. The train is heading down to Vladivostok. Okay, well, time to go to home. Time to go home. Okay. See you later.